I just keep reflecting on how gracious and merciful you are. You know, just thinking of the journey it took to get here and even still the things you're working on me and um, yeah, just thank you for never giving up. I just pray that your will will be done and not mine, that you'll use me um, in this next season to just bring the children to you, Lord. We have prayed for someone that has had a heart for kids, who sees what they can become. When I see Modesto with kids, you see the joy that he has with them. He knows their name and story. He's so faithful and a person you want leading and equipping these kids for the future. I'm truly honored and excited about what he brings to Kid City. When Modesto first came here, he would respond to um, a question or a task by yes ma'am. And I remember thinking, I hope my kids do that. And now when I ask my children to do something, they say yes ma'am. So Modesto, thank you for what you bring. You are leading and they are watching. Well, as a kid growing up, I didn't have someone to tell me about God or tell me that, you know, we would make it out of the hood or even someone to share their hope with me. You know, I had and have awesome parents and they loved me the best way that they knew how. My father was sick since before I was born and he passed away when I was 14. He never taught me how to ride a bike or how to swim or how to talk to girls. You know, he didn't see me get my first job, my car, go to prom, graduate high school. He's never heard any of my songs. Um, he's never even seen me perform and he won't even see this video. All right, ready? Here we go. We're not gonna mess up this time. All right, okay. three, Boy, so two, just, just one. <laughs> when we met Modesto, he was setting up for a youth group night and he was putting all the tech and the chords and the speakers and the audio, the visual. He was doing all that alone. And when he moved up here from Tampa to Michigan to become an intern, an all intern here at City Life, and then completed that and then became a minister in training here at City Life, and now being formally announced as a minister of City Life, we've watched that story of how we met him play out time and time again. To do the work that no one else was do doing when no one was looking. And he did it out of a love for God and a love for people. God gave us Jesus. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. As a kid growing up in the hood, desiring a father figure, I found myself filling voids in all areas like drugs and girls and money and gangs, fighting. You know, I was always empty and my tendency was to isolate. And I thank God that he sent people across my way to start to reach me and invite me to church, you know, and it, and it came a long way. Modesto just have, has a heart like, like it's not even describable. He just has a heart for the people and for kids. Um, and we're just really blessed to have him. Um, yeah, Modesto is the epitome of faith and, and uh, being faithful and, and dedicated and, and love and loving like Jesus does. So we're just so blessed to have him. We gotta tell them that we belong. My heart is to be someone for the kids that I didn't get to have when I was their age. Someone to show them that there is hope, that this pain doesn't last long, that even without an earthly father, we can begin to experience and know that God, our father, has endless love for us. The kids that we get to invest in will help change the city, help change the world, one life at a time. And Jesus said, let the children come to him. And I just want to help with that. Now, I'm not perfect, by no means, but to be able to help these kids to the one who is perfect, that's a privilege. His passion for the kids is contagious. He has a love to see kids be rooted in Jesus. And I really believe God's gonna use him here throughout our city, the 517 state, nation, and world to invest in the future. We believe if you can be trusted with the broom, you can be trusted with the room. Modesto has been trusted with the broom, studying, preparing, and he has a call in his life that has been confirmed by the leaders here and so many doing the work when no one's looking. 
that it is our honor now to announce him formally on his birthday, our City Life Next Minister, Modesto Martinez. Kid City, where you at? Kid City, where you at? Kid City, where you at?